That's right. And when she was getting pretty old, uh, she was in the hospital. Well, she lived pretty much in the hospital there for, for a while at the end. And I brought a girlfriend there to, to meet her when she was in the bed. And she pretty much had no problem saying at that point whatever she thought, which apparently happens when you get older. I'm looking forward to that. Uh, no, that's right. But uh, my, my girlfriend was standing there with me and uh, my grandmother, Grandma Ava, said, Scott, she said something about some music and my girlfriend didn't really react or respond. And she, she said, come down here to the bed. I leaned down and, uh, and Grandma said, she's not the one. I don't, I don't think she likes music. Which was not true. This girlfriend in particular loved music. But my grandmother had no problem saying, she's not the one. Um, I tell you that story because we're going to do a gospel song now, and this is uh, where, where these, these things come from. What's the real story? Why did I marry that? No, I didn't. I didn't marry that girl. <laughs> now, I don't really know what the real story is. I'm hearing it for the no. first time right now as well. But all right, it turned out it wasn't actually my grandmother. I had the wrong room. And, Wrong hospital. Uh, I don't know. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I don't know. I just uh, really, I feel like the only thing that's sticking with me from that story is that his girlfriend. She was probably only like like three feet away. There's no question she heard it. Yeah, that was the point of the story. Yeah. I forgot that. Point. This is funny. She basically was like, "What the hell, Scott?" <laughs> All right, this is just a closer walk. Yeah. Just a closer walk with me. Granny 
Jesus is mine. Just a closer walk with me. Just a closer walk with me. Daily walking close. 